All right, guys, today I'm sharing with you an affirmation that was used by the man, the myth, the legend, Bob Proctor. And this affirmation he kept with him for years. And allegedly, he said that this affirmation caused him to do things that led to him being, you know, financially free and abundant and wealthy. So the affirmation is, I am so happy and grateful that money comes to me from multiple sources of income on a continuous basis in increasing quantities. So this affirmation was actually in one of his books and in a lot of his videos. And he spoke about it many times, that it was one of the reasons that he reprogrammed his subconscious mind and he had a paradigm shift. And the paradigm is just a set of habitual thinking. So he changed that by reading this affirmation feelingly like he reprogrammed his subconscious mind. As we said before, guys, the subconscious mind responds to two things, repetition and feelings, like congruent emotion, something like that. If you have these two together, you will make an impression on the subconscious mind. And as we have said, you are a projector. And this 3D reality that we are living in is just what you are projecting on it. So everything comes from the inside. So if you want to change the outer world, you got to change what's inside of you first. And how you're going to do that is through repetition or visualizing feelingly. How would it like to be like successful, be a millionaire, being happily married, being in a good shape? These things will make an impression in your subconscious mind. And you can easily do that when you wake up and right before going to sleep. Why? Because these are the two times that your mind is at alpha brainwave state. And at alpha, you are opening up the subconscious mind wide open. So whatever you say to yourself at these times, you will experience. Because you are impressing the subconscious mind at these times. Actually, when you were young, you used to listen to your parents, listen to the TV programs, listen to your teachers in school, and you believed what was said back then because you were actually operating at theta and alpha brainwave states and these goes directly into the subconscious mind so you actually believe that the world is what they are telling you it is when in reality you create your own reality by doing this by reprogramming your subconscious mind day in and day out going to sleep feeling successful, feeling that you have already achieved what you want, you will make an impression on the subconscious mind. And once you do that, your whole life will change because a sequence of events will occur. Like a sequence of events will occur all of a sudden. You will be like under compulsion to do things that you wouldn't normally do. But these things will aid you to have what you want. Say, for example, that you are imagining counting down like hundred thousand dollars in cash every day to sleep you will wake up and you will do things you wouldn't normally do if you sleep like feeling sad and defeated and like a victim no if you sleep feeling successful like you are counting down hundred dollar bills every single night to sleep you will wake up go to places you wouldn't normally go to meeting people that you wouldn't normally meet and eventually you will get to that thing that you want which is the 100k right so if you are sleeping doing something you will experience it in this world some people say it's it's impossible to do that how you do that no it's not impossible try it you actually probably climbed the ladder right so climbing the ladder was a symbol that whatever you do while you are falling asleep you will experience if you're not loving what's happening in your world right now it's just what you've been thinking of and thinking feelingly before you go to bed for years. If you go to bed feeling defeated and feeling like you are a victim of the world, you will always be that. But if you always go to bed feeling successful, feeling like you are doing things that you love, feeling like you are winning in life, even though the evidence of the senses is denying it, if you persist in that assumption, it will harden into fact. And this is the key, guys. Feeling is the secret. Feeling is not an emotion, even though emotions might help. But feeling is the acceptance of the end, the acceptance that you already have what you want, the acceptance that you are the person that you want to be. 
the acceptance that you got the money that you want, the physique that you want, the partner that you want, the business that you want, whatever it may be. If you accept that, and I know sometimes people can say it's hard. You know, it's like saying like, if manifestation is real, why not everybody is a millionaire? I would answer like this. If there is gems everywhere, why not everybody get a six pack? Because not everybody is applying what is being taught. Not everybody is going to the gym. Not everybody is actually doing what is supposed to be done in order to get what you want. Not a lot of people are doing it. And people are lazy. People want like to sit down all day long and just say that this doesn't work and this doesn't work and I don't believe in that before even trying. People are so defeated and so programmed to the point that sometimes it makes me a bit angry. But then I just go back to my normal state and say like they are on their own path. So if you are watching this video, then you impressed your subconscious mind that you need to have something or you need to do something. You impressed the subconscious mind with an idea and a sequence of events happened and occurred and here I am talking to you. So if you are watching this, I want you to know that you are on the right path. You are doing it correctly. You just need to persist. Think feelingly of what you want and it will materialize into the 3D realm that we are living in. What is here will be externalized in the hologram that we are living in. Everything is here and now. So you can use a lot of techniques, but what you are looking for is the feeling that it's already done. Whether it's affirmation, whether it's visualization, whether it's scripting, whether it's whatever. I don't care what it is. Once you have a technique that you feel satisfied doing, then stay with that technique and your wish will be fulfilled. And once your wish will be fulfilled, you will be amazed how powerful we are. We are infinite beings. We are multidimensionally living. We are everywhere. But we decided to experience this linear time. We decided to experience this 3D reality. But you can have whatever you want because everything is here and now. So believe in yourself, believe that you already have what you want and it will be materialized in your world. So that's it for today. I hope you find it helpful. If you did, subscribe to the channel, like to reach more people and I will see you soon.